Hello, welcome to Card Minds. Thank you for stopping by. This is going to be a Virgo career reading for the month of November 2021. All signs are up for general readings for the month of November if you're interested in taking a look at those. And a heads up, these are general energies, not personal readings. I would not be able to answer any personal questions. All right, Virgo, let's see. Oh, let's see what we have here in this career reading. Nine of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles, Queen of Swords, a Virgo career reading, Page of Cups. Virgo career, November. Virgo career, November. Eight of swords. Virgo career, November. Okay. Ten of wands. Six of Swords, the Hierophant, the Star, Virgo, Career. November 2021 Virgo year 2021 Okay Virgo The Emperor Interesting And Page of Swords. All right, Virgo. We have, in this month of November, one, two, three major arcana in a row here. Uh, Hierophant, the Star, and the Emperor. And... We start with the Nine of Pentacles. This Nine of Pentacles has come out pretty much in every reading. I feel like all signs are pushing forward to independence, independent energy, financially independent, professionally independent, right? That's what everybody strives for, usually, in normal circumstances, to have financial and comfort and independence but it is a recurring card that comes out that has come out in every single reading nine of pentacles right um abundance and independence and feeling comfortable in life comfortable financially long-term financial security and that is something that you are pushing forward Ten of Wands, you're at the end of a cycle, an end of a cycle that has been difficult, that has been, um, I feel like it's the end of a professional cycle. Eight of Swords, Ten of Wands, Six of Swords. You're in a transitional period. You have been blocked. It has been a while. It has been difficult. Um, heavy 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 energies right ten of um ten of wands too many responsibility too much responsibility um sort of too much work overload um and overwhelming stress at work uh whatever job 
you have or whatever job you had because I feel like you are in a transition period, six of swords, moving forward into something different, moving forward to a different job, to a different project, to a different business. Take it as it resonates in your journey. Um, you, because it has been stressful, Eight of Swords, because you were restricted, because you felt your perspectives were, you didn't have any perspectives, right? And and not, not surprising because we are at the tail end of this worldwide situation. We were all blocked. Um, and uh, I feel like the summer, the, the summer was uh, the moment where everybody had the hermit card, you know, the, the completion, the end of that soul searching, that path, that next path we were going to wake up to. What am I, what am I doing next? Am I keeping this job? Am I keeping this career? Am I going back to this career? Am I going back to this job? Can I sustain remotely? Can I sustain with my second job? Can I take other jobs? Can I make mother money differently? Right? We're opening up after that, that uh, long period of um, doubt and uh, and just soul searching, deep soul searching on what who we are and what we want next after this period. And the month of September, since the month of September, we have opened up. I say we as a collective open up to our new energies. We are different people. We are different energies now after that long dormant period. So coming out of these energies, we now have to adapt to our new desires, to our new ways of working, to our new energies of what we can put on the table, what we represent, what work ethic we have, and how we are pushing forward in this new step in this new chapter and I feel like you are moving into a new chapter now something more comfortable for you something with an equal give and take six of six of pentacles and you see clear now you understand now you have you you now know what you want Virgo and what you do know is that you don't want to go back to that lack of perspective, right? Just being blocked in that job and really nothing else to offer and nothing much going on around you, right? And you don't want to go back to that. Those overwhelming jobs, a lot of pressure, a lot of work, and not much perspective. And you know, Queen of Swords, that you're, knowing, you're not going back there. And you now you 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 you're not going back there, and you're 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 transitioning, six of swords, into your next chapter, um, but this is going to require Virgo. You have six of pentacles. Um, there's a lot of generosity there. There's a lot of um, caring in your environment, caring for others. Maybe you care for others. Maybe you're taking care of your family. Maybe you have to care for, for kids, for elderly, right? And, but there's a lot of generosity around you. Six of Pentacles. However it is for you, take it as it resonates in your journey. You are pushing forward in something much more balanced professionally it's a it's a new energy page of cups page of swords this new chapter is a total new energy and you want with this page you want you want you you're starting something new and you're really you want something more fulfilling and you're going to find something more fulfilling. This page of cups is an offer, is a message, is an offer. Maybe something out of the blue. Maybe something you, you, you didn't even think of. The star, 
believing. I think this offer here is something that's taking you out, all of a sudden, out of this, this, and, and giving you clarity and taking you out of whatever this was blocking you, whatever this job was that you didn't want to do anymore, whatever, or even the lack of perspective of not having a job. Beautiful offer here, Page of Cups. And it's, it's, it's not only an offer, but I really believe that it's something favorable for you, something that's going to happen because you have the star and the hierophant. And you also have the Page of Swords. And the Page of Swords is uh, wanting to um, learn, eager to learn more, even um, uh, eager to uh, boss up, to... Um, go back to school to get new skills to you know get a new diploma bossing up you're inspired you're intelligent and you're this offer here uh virgo is something that is really pushing you forward in a whole new dynamic and this it's inspiring you you're excited and and you're you're very very eager to boss up in this new job, in this new offer, project, job, business, take it as it resonates in your journey. But, but it's, it's inspiring. And pages are beginnings, budding beginnings of this new energy. And you have the higher fit. So I believe, I, I really think that this offer is something that is, um, requires you to uh, restructure right? To either go back to school to get a diploma or to um, uh, learn new skills or, or you know, I, I feel like it's something completely different. And, and it's something that is asking you, it is an offer, a job, a project that's asking you to conform to certain ideas, to conform to a certain way of working. So you're going to have to adjust and this might be an offer out of the blue um a virgo but you're you're going to have to adjust and it's in a good way because this is something that you really believe in i really think this is faded this is something that you believe in and this is something that is um very fulfilling very fulfilling and bringing you financial stability so beautiful virgo absolutely beautiful and so this hierophant is requiring you to boss up, to boss up, to get whatever skills you need, to, to adapt to the situation, to adapt to the rules, to adapt to whatever is offered to you, which might, might not be the type of job that you had before. That might be, this might be a whole new career. You're discovering a whole new career. You, you are uh, learning right? Learning new skills, adapting to this new career, this newfound career that you're very excited about. And the star, this is something really that you, um, you believe in. It is, um, you're, you're fitting in with others, right? You're not, you're not creating, you're not, it's not an artistic, um, uh, a job. This is something that you're, you, you, some, something you have to follow rules, right? A structure that is already there and fit in within this structure that's already there, but it's giving you wings. It really is the star. You believe in this. Um, and you know, and we have the, the, uh, the emperor right here and the emperor, I think, can be the person that you're that's offering you this job. This is a powerful leader, a powerful boss. This is a mentor. This is um, some someone that will partner with you or that will really help you and advocate for you. That really believes in you in this job and that's going to push you forward and give you this opportunity. Uh, beautiful opportunity, but they are, but they do demand this, this emperor is very powerful. They, they demand loyalty, right? It's sort of follow me. 
and be loyal, right? It, it's someone, but it's someone you, I really think you look up to because you believe in this person, the star, right? You believe in this person. This is something that, probably something that you really didn't expect, right? The, the page of cups can be something really out of the blue, uh, a job offer out of the blue. It is a beautiful opportunity. All right, let's see. Let's see if we can uh, get a little more information about this amazing job. All right. Now, I don't know if you're starting this job yet um, because I don't have aces here. We'll see if we pull some cards, uh, some aces. But it's definitely the offer is coming here. The offer is here, I believe, from this emperor of, and then the Hierophant, you know, making things happen, learning, adapting, following. Uh, it is, you know, like being a teacher. You have to follow rules, right? Uh, need a diploma or or becoming a nurse, or, you know, or just becoming, you know, or just a, a business that requires you to, you know, uh, acquire new skills and just go back and get a diploma, or having this, this emperor mentoring you, teaching you new skills in this new environment, right? When we have a new career, something we've never done before, but someone that truly believes in us, that inspires us and that believes in us in a job that we've never done before. That is wonderful out of the blue. That's helping you along the way, um, teaching you these new skills. That is what the Hierophant and the Emperor is all about. It's, this is really beautiful. Let's see. Yes. Okay. So, I'm going to put this right here. The five of pentacles is just coming out. Um, the five of pentacles is loss of finances, maybe loss of a job, just feeling left out, feeling stuck. And, and that goes with the ten of wands and the eight of swords, you know, that stuck, no, no, no perspective, right? And, and, and just, you, you might have lost your job during the world situation um, and, and just felt left out and, and not seeing the light. But this November is really, really coming, coming together in this new beginning. All right. What is this uh, nine of, yes, nine. I'm going to put this right here this justice card. Justice is making decisions, right? Understanding that you have to make a decision. And I feel like this goes with this offer here. <clears throat> because you have the Queen of Swords understanding, seeing clear of what is going on, seeing clear that you have to push forward, right? That you you do now have a perspective and you are laser focused on making this happen. And now you have the justice, which is saying that you have to make that, that serious decision that is going to impact your life, right? And that, or, and, and you are going to be rewarded for making this decision and managing your finances carefully. And so this is the reward, this job offer out of the blue. And um, you might have to move, right? It, these are, this is a big decision. This is a big transition. This is a you know, so the, the, you might have to move, you might have to change. You're also changing careers. I believe this is a completely new career. So big changes that might impact you, your family, or, you know, your surroundings, moving to a different city, complete different environment or same city, but just completely different, right? Moving to a different area. You can be moving with this six of swords, 
different country, right? But no matter what, this emperor is offering you something completely new. So it is, it does require life decisions. Comment down below. Let me know uh, what your situation is. All your energies push me forward. All your comments push me forward. Yes, you're opening up. Yes, that Queen of Swords is now knows that there's perspective. All of a sudden, the, these doors are opening for you for something completely new. And you're you're ready to take on the world. It is it is the two of wands. The two of wands is opening up to the world, opening up to this new perspective, opening up to this new job. And it's progress in this career. It is a new job, no matter what. This is new. I keep saying new, 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 right? But it is. It is progress. It's moving forward. You're getting more responsibility. You're bossing up. And you're opening up to the world. You're opening up your horizons. You're ready to discover the world. Really. And as you felt so stuck in the past energies, now it's just opening wide open in front of you. Take it, take it, uh, Virgo, because this is something really, really beautiful that's offered to you. Don't be scared, <laughs> right? Don't be scared. Yes, don't be scared. I have all these cards coming out. Seven of Wands. You know, it's uh, it's challenging. This might be a, a job that's challenging. Uh, something you've never done before. So it might be a little stressful. There's a might be a lot of competition. This person is hiring you and you, you've never done this before. So it might be a little anxiety because there might be competition, pressure, other people you have to work with, right? Because you have to conform, you have to adapt. Uh, it might be, you know, and you, but you're making more money. So this is something you have to adapt to, right? So uh, keep your boundaries, uh, keep your, you know, keep, keep your boundaries, keep your calm. Everything's going to be okay, right? Keep your calm, align yourself, four of swords, align yourself, take a breather. Um, because I feel like you, you have had deceptions, five of, five of cups, right? You've had challenges, you've had disagreements, and that is why you had the five of pentacles here. And you are, you, so just, Remember that this is a completely new energy and a completely new career, right? You have, again, the Queen of Swords. So I, I almost think that this job that is amazing, that you didn't believe you would get, that's some, something sort of out of the blue that you didn't expect at all, something you've never done before. So it's a little stressful when someone believes in us. It has happened to me when someone believes in us and out of the blue to do something we've never done before that we never even thought of doing. It is a little stressful, right? Can we do it? Can we adapt? Can we learn? Can we learn a skill we, we don't have? Do we know how to do it? How's this going to work? And I think all that is in your head, right? All that is in your head, but at the same time, you're laser focused, excited because you're going to accept this job. I mean, again, free will, this is only a card reading, but but it, it it's at the same time, it's giving you that focus and that drive that you were missing, right? That you were, uh, and and you're you're just energized and enthusiastic in this new chapter but at the same time it it's stressful and it and and it triggers past anxieties right you have the you know waking up past anxieties of course because it's the stress of a job and there's competition and there are other people there right but push forward push forward virgo because honestly this is this is something this is like something once in a lifetime that someone really believes in you. So boss up and and push forward. But you're very, very focused. Yes, five of five of swords conflict. You're getting out of that, though, uh, Virgo. You're out of that. This is a whole new chapter. You're out of the, the ego fights, the difficulties, the competition, the ego powers, ego powers, ego powers. 
right? There might be ego powers in this new job, but just in a different way. This is a new energy. This is dynamic. This is this is energizing you. This is good stress, not bad stress. Um, I feel like you're leaving those ego powers behind. I'm going to put this here. Leaving that behind. You're leaving that stress behind. Now is now is a complete new chapter. All right, what is this Hierophant about? Clarify the Hierophant. I think that everybody has... Okay, you you keep getting this stress, <laughs> stressful, stressful, stressful conflict, right? All right, but it you the you know it because it's competitive. I think the the five of swords is ego and and um, competition. The five of wands is sort is challenges. So this is challenging. It is a new job. It is a new career that you are putting in place. And you might be, you know, going back to school, studying or being or apprenticing or this this emperor is mentoring you and it's challenging. It's not easy. It's not easy. But hang in there because this job is opening your your life, opening up to this new world. And financially secure. I keep going back to the Nine of Pentacles. So push forward. Push forward. This is something worth it. Yes, look at this. King of Pentacles. Might be the same person. King of Pentacles and uh, Emperor. Can be. King of Pentacles. But if it's not the same person, someone... Um, the King of Pentacles is uh, someone very well installed in their career, someone that is um, uh, business savvy, someone that has um, uh, the discipline and 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 um, the uh, power to transform businesses into reality, to make money, right? A leader, um, and. I, I, I really, really think the emperor and the, um, and the uh, king of pentacles is the same person. Someone with a uh, very, very fan financially secure, someone comfortable, someone generous, leading the way, helping you, guiding you through this new career. And if it's not them, you are in your power, Virgo. Definitely. You are disciplined. You are pushing through in this new career. And you are, you are bringing in financial comfort, financial abundance, and long-term security. Which goes back to the Nine of Pentacles. Fulfilled in this job. And, yes, and... Um, this is, this is uh, something that's really rewarding rewarding because you're making big choices in your life this is a big transformation in your life someone believing in you like that offering this job out of the blue you it is changing your life it is life-changing but there's a lot of conflict the con conflictual thoughts in your mind right back and forth back and forth back and forth can i do this can i go back into stress uh do i know how to do this uh, I have to boss up. I, you know, um, it's stressful. It, you know, there's a lot of competition. I'm going back in there. Can I do this? Yes, you can. Yes, you can. The emperor. And you have the judgment. So you have justice and judgment. I mean, both of these cards are about complete life-changing decisions and the judgment is about a complete new career thinking different new path and it's funny because this judgment in this situation here with the emperor is saying that if you were ever considered for a job 
if you are ever up for a job or a promotion, but I don't think it's a promotion. I think this is a complete new path, complete new job. You, you are truly considered to get this job. Wow. Complete new path, complete new career. Trust that this is your path because they trust you. They want you on their team. They believe in you. Trust this new path, uh, Virgo. Even though in your mind, it can be a little conflictual because of the stress that comes with it. Wow. Very interesting reading, Virgo. It is inspiring you, though. Push forward, Virgo. All right, let's see if there's one last message for the road. One last message. Yeah. And, and again, this is coming out. <laughs> the, I'm not surprised. The Eight of Swords. Because I'm feeling, at the same time, excited about this new career. The challenges. But at the same time, the challenges of this new career. And sort of the PTSD of the... Um, the previous career that was stressful and you felt left out and you felt stuck with no perspective and just blocked and blocked and blocked. And and so this Eight of Swords is coming out again. But know that this is bringing abundance. It's, it's demanding a lot of effort. It is a complete new career. You have to hone up your skills. You might have to go back to school. There's a lot of effort to put in this new job, but it's so rewarding. It's so worth it. Um, Virgo. I hope you enjoyed this reading, uh, Virgo, as much as I did. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you each and every one of you for your subscribes, your comments, your likes. Uh, keep the comments going. I have uh, This little channel has just passed 3K, so I want to really thank all of you. I'm very grateful for everyone that watches this channel. If you've never watched this channel before and this is your first reading, um, you might want to go back to mid-October career readings or October career readings, as well as uh, uh, money and career focuses for the end of the year, October, November, December. Uh, plus, all signs are up for general readings for the month of October. Thank you so much for watching. Virgo, take care. Bye-bye.